Hello folks, how y'all doing out there in the internet land? My name is Cam Kimbrough, BKA Cameron Kimbrough, the grandson of the late great Junior Kimbrough. Here to give y'all a couple of tunes and a couple of ideas and opinions about a couple of things. First up, I'd like to thank Smoke Free Music City Project for allowing me to be a part of this project uh, to begin with. And I'd also like to thank American Non-Smokers Rights Foundation for keeping us musicians and everyone who works inside of a smoke field venues free of smoke and to promote health and ongoing for all mankind. Myself and I uh, uh, used to be a tobacco user and I can tell you firsthand, very nasty experience. It's like every morning I would wake up, I would have like this mucus buildup. Uh, I guess it was like the tar in the cigarettes, uh, which I wasn't really paying attention. I was kind of, I would call myself a moderate smoker. I didn't even really smoke a full pack of cigarettes a day. Um, maybe I smoked three to five cigarettes. Uh, it started out to be one or two every other day from hanging around uh, my friends or associates who smoked. And eventually I started to smoke. Uh, but still, I can tell you the 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 the, the tar and, and just the smell is just very nasty. And then, I mean, who wants to smell that if they're really not a smoker? It was very stinky. Um, so basically, it's it was a bad experience. And uh, myself and my bandmate um, Damian Pearson, uh, aka Yellow P, in the band Mississippi Sounds, we had we played this uh, international competition here in Memphis. And uh, smoke field venue, I didn't know this because I had never really been in this particular place before. It was already filled with people from all over the world and I'm pretty sure like everybody wasn't cool with it, but it, that's what we were contending for the night. So uh, 
some smoke everywhere. I mean, you know, it was people who were sitting at the bar, which that's where I was sitting. You couldn't really get away from it. I mean, it was packed. It was shoulder to shoulder in the building the whole night. And uh, it really made it hard to perform. It made seem like it made my vocal cords way heavier and just more raspy and just my eyes were burning. And it was, we, I, I think, me and him both got headaches that night because uh, it was just, it was so much smoke in there. But yeah, so that was definitely a bad experience with that. So if you do smoke, I would definitely advise you to be mindful of others that are around you because second and third hand smoke both contain uh, airborne toxins, uh, which is just as deadly as first hand smoke, you know, the person smoking a cigarette. So yeah, on that note, let's be thoughtful, baby. Let's not smoke. <laughs> I'm out.